This is Captain Mark Johnson from FloridaKeysFunFishing.com. We're here at Angler House Marina with the boys from Salt Strong. In today's episode, we're going to talk about tackle organization and maximizing your efficiency. Because when you can't wait to get off of work Friday and you want to go fishing on Saturday, it's nice to have your stuff organized, situated, and ready to go instead of running around the fire drill on a Saturday morning trying to launch your boat in with all your stuff thrown in a big pile. So here in the charter business, what we do, with the amount of boats and captains and gear we have, we put together a real nice, what we call our tackle trailer. So I'm going to run you guys through here really quick and show you how organized it is, some of the things we keep in the man cave that are necessity for us, and it just helps keeping all of our boats, guys, trips, tackle, everything organized, and again, maximum efficiency is what we're after. Okay, so in our little tackle trailer when you come on in here we have a couple different things we have a table for projects where we sharpen knives uh, have extra rags break reels all kinds of little things that we just kind of get on that to-do list and you move right into what we do every day we have all of our boat cleaning stuff we have miscellaneous tools and air compressors for doing all of our trailer tires we have all of our oils for our Gear, gear change, lower unit oil, uh, motor oil, and filters, props. We come with extra hoses. We get down into the tackle world. We have all of our braided line. We keep all of our tackle in boxes. It's all very organized because we got to keep five boats running, lots of rods. We have shirts that we use for all of our clientele. We have shirts for sale, so we have to keep them all situated. They're folded nice. We have them all labeled so you can find them. We keep all of our dive gear. We have extra life jackets for kids. We have a whole bunch of cast nets for different things. We have our bait freezer. We filter our own drinking water through our hosing system here at the marina. And then we have our rod racks. Okay, half our boats are out today, so half my rods are missing. But we have over 150 rods, and they're all very similar. And we also have a lot of specialty rods. So every captain, all of our boats have their own bundles. We have fly rods and stuff separate. We have heavy conventional rods separate. And then we have spare anchors and life jackets. And there's just a plethora of stuff that keeps us moving every day. And again, organized tackle, maximum efficiency. There are months where we've been humble enough to push a high volume of trips. And if you get four, five, six boats working every day, you got tackle breaking, tackle working, you're running out of hooks, need zip locks for fish, bait in the freezer, it is endless. The more organized it is, the more efficient we are. It's no different if you're the weekend dad trying to go fishing with your family. You get home from work late Friday, you want to go Saturday. If your tackle bag and stuff was put away the weekend before and you organize your stuff and you know where it is and you clean your rods and reels properly, then it's all ready to go for you the next day. And I can't stress that enough. That just makes your Saturday fishing with your family or your buddies that much more enjoyable. Okay, so in the last little bit too, we do keep some tools and stuff here because we do a lot of our own maintenance and they come really in handy. And then as well as oil filter wrenches, all this stuff that we keep, we use this stuff day in, day out. And once again, this is Captain Mark Johnson from FloridaKeysFunFishing.com and Salt Strong. And I'm here to just talk about tackle, organization, and maximizing your efficiency. If you guys have any questions how to set up a garage, how to build a rod rack, how, what kind of tools you should keep close by, you can find us again on Salt Strong, and you can always find us at FloridaKeysFunFishing.com. There's something about the water that'll give you peace All by yourself or with your family Live salt strong and wear the line today